Phlegius, the arrogant and foolish king of the Lapiths in Greek mythology, visited the temple of Apollo at Delphi. He was so impious that he attempted to rape the Pythia, the priestess of Apollo. Apollo, angered by Phlegius' misdeeds, struck him down with an arrow. As a result, the city of Orchomenus, ruled by Phlegius, was destroyed by a terrible earthquake. In the afterlife, Phlegius was condemned to eternal torment for his impiety. His punishment was to become the ferryman of the river Styx, which divided the realm of the living from that of the dead. Phlegius' role was to ferry the souls of the deceased across the river, but he often capsized his boat or delayed his passengers, causing them further suffering and prolonging their agony. Phlegius' tragic fall became a warning to others who mocked the power of the gods, as he became a symbol for the dangers of pride and impious behavior. Phlegius, the ruler of Orchomenos, was a proud and powerful man who was not afraid to show his strength. He named the district after himself, calling it Phlegiantus, to honor his own legacy when he became the governor. One day, his daughter, Caronis, fell in love with Ischis, a man who Phlegius disapproved of. Their secret affair was soon discovered by Apollo, who sent Artemis to kill Caronis. Hermes, the god of messengers, managed to rescue the unborn child, named Asclepius, from Caronis' womb and gave it to Chiron, the centaur, to raise. When Apollo killed Caronis, Phlegius was filled with anger and rage, so he decided to burn down the Apollonian temple at Delphi. But Apollo was not pleased and punished Phlegius by shooting him with his arrows and condemning him to the lower world for punishment. There, he suffered in Tartarus, as depicted in Virgil's Aeneid, warning others not to despise the gods. In another version of the myth, Phlegius' death resulted from the actions of Lycus and Nyctius. He was entombed in a rock by Majira in the underworld and starved in front of an eternal feast, as described in Statius Thebaid. Phlegius learned the hard way that ignoring the power of the gods would only lead to his downfall. Do you want to explore more Greek mythology stories? Who do you want to see featured next? Subscribe and leave a comment below to let me know. I'll see you in the next video.